Welcome to Good Mythical More. Today, we present to each other and to you collectively five of our favorite TikTok creators right now. But first, it's gift equality time. We're donating $1,000 to the NAACP Legal Defense and Educational Fund to aid in their mission to fight for racial justice through litigation, advocacy, and public education. Join us in giving at NAACPLDF.org slash donate. Thank you for being your mythical best and for hanging out with us in the more. Um, TikTok, it, TikTok. You know, it's, it's been around a while. There's, there's. There was an evolution of understanding of what there always TikTok is. was. There always is. It's also an evolution of what TikTok is becoming. You know, at at what I'll call at first. I don't even know if it was at first, but once people started talking about it, it's like a bunch of bunch of people dancing. Well, and it, okay, it, when you have teenagers in your home, uh, which we do because we have children uh, of the teenage, you quickly learn that. I learned that they were all of a sudden all on this this app, which I eventually I initially thought it was like this is how out of touch I was. I just thought it was like musically, right? Because I, I was like, that's like the lip sync thing, right? Well, now it's so kind of like dancing. The, it's kind of like the lip sync thing, but you're dancing. I was like, okay. But then with with when quarantine hit, and you know everybody started showing up on this thing. J Lo's on this thing. Oh, I haven't seen. Some, I haven't you, seen that. You got some celebrities. I haven't seen J Lo's channel. You got you got celebrities getting in on the action, but the but the thing that got us the most excited was when you started to see distinct comedic voices rise to the top of our for you pages as we started to in dive a, into in it. a way that's reminiscent of the early days of YouTube. Like there hasn't been another platform that's really, I mean, I guess Vine kind of did this, but that was six x six sex. It was six sex on Vine. That's why I quit watching. <laughs> No, it was six seconds at a time, and Southern boys can't do anything in six seconds. So that was something that we would have never been good at. Um, and TikTok gives you a little bit more, a little bit more flexibility. So let's, yeah, talk, there, about, let's talk about who, who we're into, who we're following. Doing some funny things. Okay, so actually one of the first people that I followed was this guy, Caleb W. Francis, who's just a dude in West Virginia. West Virginia? Who's got a... Uh, a weird sense of humor. Let's watch one of his, one of my favorites from him. This must be good. Okay. Hey, Jeremy, come here. What's up? If I drink the juice out of all these and then puke it up, would you eat it? Mm. I don't know, maybe. Like, eat it off the ground? No. Remember all the hexagons we've been building? <laughs> of course, we've been building hexagons for like two weeks straight now. There's like a million hexagons at the house. <laughs> I'll just puke in those. Fill them to the top with puke. <laughs> I thought the hexagons were for baby storage. I mean, there's plenty of hexagons for babies and flower juice puke. What if we made the babies eat the puke? Yes, dude. Let's make babies eat our puke. Well, get to sucking. We're going to need plenty of puke. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jeremy. First bees to make honey. That's what that was. Jeremy is a, is a perfect bee name. Yeah. And it, I mean, he's filming himself. He's just out there with he's looking phone, in different directions, just filming himself, being all the characters. Uh, he does another thing. He so uh, one of the things that's happened on TikTok is is people will kind of come back to the same series, right? Yeah. And he's got this one where he plays uh, two brothers and their dad, and um, this is one of them. this is one of the one of the appropriate ones, somewhat appropriate. I couldn't show you my favorite. It's just. It'd be too much to bleep and blur. No, not blur, just bleep. Oh, blur? <laughs> Let's watch this one. Okay. Hey, is it me or does it smell like up dog in here? Oh yeah, dad found a dead one in the basement this morning. It's real big and stinky. Huh? It's probably twice the size of the last one that got in there. The last one? There's two? What makes you so sure it's an up dog? Because of the horns. Horns? You wanna go spit on it? No? Why not? It's the only way to banish their soul from this realm. What? What is it? Boys, I need you in the basement right now. The up dog wasn't dead. I need all the spit we can muster. <laughs> Coming, Dad. What the f is going on? <laughs> <laughs> uh, is up dog, does that float around your house? Because there was a little bit of time there. Right. And you know, when you got 
when you got the younger kid, it finally gets to them, and then nobody falls for it. So with right. Lando, yeah. nobody's falling. So just for in the case you weren't following closely, that's Spin usually on. a joke where you say, "Does it smell like up dog in here?" And the other person says, "What's up, dog?" And then you're like, "Gotcha!" Uh, don't dad explain. Well, I'm doing hey, it. Is for that the, another tick? Is, I'm should doing that be a tick? For the seventeen percent who weren't following along. You think they deserve to get it? Yeah, I want you to be able to enjoy it. Now rewind and watch it again. I like Caleb. I want I want to hang out with Caleb F. Francis, or is it just? It's Caleb F. Francis. Caleb W. Francis. It's, Cal it's Cal Caleb W. Francis, right. He, I like when somebody makes their username their actual name. That would be you on the what? driver's license. I would be fine hanging out with Caleb's brother, or his dad, yeah, yeah. or those bees he knows. Right. All right, what I want to show you is Vanessa Simeon, VFlow underscore XO. Apparently, she either she she works at a gas station behind the cash register. You, have you seen her? I haven't seen her, but there, I, there's another guy who does the same thing. This must well, be a, listen, a genre. Well, listen, I don't care about. No, who I'm else just does saying it. that it must be a thing on TikTok to work at a place and you make TikToks. I haven't in there. seen anybody but Vanessa, okay. and no one's better than her. Check this one out. You want your receipt? What do you think? I'm gonna bring this back? I'm just doing my job, sir. Well, have some damn common sense. I'm gonna eat it. I'm gonna have some common sense. I'm gonna eat it. The the thing that I love about these, I have theories about these all these videos. Just I, so you know, my theory is that people come in, and then she has an idea, and she asks them to be in the TikTok, and they're just in the TikTok. Yeah, that guy was acting. Like, <laughs> well, yeah, they're acting. No, but, but, but it's still they're good. actual customers who she just said, "Hey, will you be my TikTok? I just want you to say." When I say this, you say this. And it's just all these people parading up to the counter saying all types of stuff. I think she's in Alabama. Do we have another one? Oh yeah, this is a good one. Hey. hey. New car. Did it's you? A Marcus. It's a what? A Marcus. Can I see it? Yeah. That's nice. What is it? A Marcus. That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, I feel like I mean she usually doesn't go out and see the marketus. It just all happens at the at the counter. And her catchphrase is, "Hey." Usually that's the first thing she says. Hey. Yeah, that's how I start most of my TikToks. And once I once I watch one, I gotta watch all of them, well, and I watch them again and okay, again and again the because other, the, the humanity. The other guy I'm I, I'm not sharing uh, who does the same thing. Who well, I actually I think I, I he, I'm, he might be better. Because he he actually he does things with real people. A woman came in with a mask and she had cut a, hole, a slit in the mask so she could breathe, and he like started making fun of it. And then she's come back repeatedly and got madder and madder. And he and she's not acting. And now he's the sheriff came and served him because she's suing him and he's putting the whole story on TikTok. What? Yeah, it's great. Well, who is that? Uh, I don't know. Uh, but I love do, you, Vanessa. I do want to tell you about Lonnie. I I V. I don't know exactly how I'm supposed to say that, Lonnie I I V. Lonnie Eve. Uh, but he has, he's got a sub series where it's uh, the th thing he's most well known for, where it's God in the process of inventing an, a certain animal, <laughs> and he's like doing it with his angel buddies, like Gabriel, and it's always in the kitchen. So let's uh, let's okay. watch one of those. Now listen to me, Gabriel. These are going to be really fun because some go on pizzas. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> you like that. And then some will make you see things. Okay. <laughs> and some, Gabriel, some just kill you. You doing okay, pal? <laughs> <laughs> so, that's hilarious. Uh, that's God Creating that Mushrooms. That voice is amazing. And now, let's, Show me another one. let's see God Create the Oceans. Gabriel. <laughs> Put water everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, 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 I get it, I get it. That's smart, that's smart. That way they can have it whenever they get thirsty, whenever they get it. See, that's, that's why you in charge, that's why you in charge. Make it undrinkable. <laughs> 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 so every he's night good, this guy's, man. he's making something in the kitchen, he's like, I gotta make he's another ticket. Good. And Gabriel's always got like a towel over his shoulder, like he's stirring something up. All right, what you got for me? is the next one I'm gonna show you. It's oh, not okay, got what it. you got for me. Sarah Cooper, she takes uh, audio of Trump talking oh, and yeah. I don't think she edits it. I think she just takes a portion and then it's art, man. I mean, she's- I've, I've seen this girl, she, yes. She, the timing and the facial expressions 
Okay, just watch this one. I'm wondering what one or two of your most favored Bible uh, verses are. Well, I, I wouldn't want to get into it because to me that's very personal. You know, when I talk about the Bible, it's very personal. So I don't want to get into there's verses. No, I don't no want to get into it. No, no, verse I, that means I, a I lot just, to you that you think about or cite. The, the Bible means a lot to me, but I don't want to get into specifics. Even to cite a verse that no, you like. No, I don't want to do that. I mean, Old Testament guy or New Testament guy? Uh, probably. Other equal. person. I think it's just an incredible, the whole Bible is an incredible, I joke uh, very much so. They always hold up the art of the deal. I say my second favorite book of all time. But uh, I just think the Bible is just something very special. All right. Let, let, I want to show you what one commentary. more. commentary. About testing and negative. I test it very positively in a... In another sense, so this morning, yeah, I tested positively toward negative, right? So, no, I tested uh, perfectly this morning, meaning meaning I tested negative. Okay, and finally, this is for the dog lovers. This is just a channel where this owner has two, or let's just call him a human, has two corgis that they have cast in all kinds of incredible TikToks like this one. It's a what? It's a dragon. Oh. It snows. Oh, come on. Dad. It's a vacuum. No. It cleans the house. False. <laughs> Hand me dragons breathe fire. It scares me. So you guys are going to clean? Dad. No. <laughs> <laughs> I love this channel, man. I mean, it's so smart. I just love it. Hey, my dog, I'm going to make my dogs bark and I'm going to voice it over. And they just do it. I mean, okay. That, there's so many more where this came from. Let's watch the next one. Yep. No. It's on there. That's Oh, Lord. It's true. Stop, Dad. Olivia. Dad's right. Go check. <laughs> okay. He doesn't actually have yogurt on his nose, Olivia. He's so slow. Okay, okay, shh. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's We got to get man. some corgis, man. That's what I learned from that. What? You want to adopt a corgi? I just, not for TikTok. I mean, I just think they're very cute little dogs. All right, follow them all on short TikTok. Short little legs. Links in the description. Oh yeah, there are. Please let this go viral. Please. Get these teas shipped prime by heading over to amazon.com slash mythical.